Hey everyone, welcome to this uh, package opening. I got two packages, one right here and one right here. So um, let's get the small one out of the way first. This is from Intrade. It's from Intrade out of Lexington, Kentucky. It's a part of Amazon, I guess, or at least associated with them. This is Intrade. So uh, what did I get from Intrade? What did I order from them? Well, I, can, I can't think of the name right now, but he did a review on a certain movie that I've watched numerous times. It's a movie that's going to be celebrating 30 years. As a matter of fact, the franchise it's based on is celebrating 31 years this year. But what did I get that's associated with that franchise, and do you know what franchise I'm talking about? Well, let's open it up and see, shall we? Let's open it up and see exactly what I got from Intrade, courtesy of Amazon.com. Uh, open it up. Is there anything inside? Any receipts? Nope. No receipt. And what did I get from Intrade? How about Transformers the movie, the original motion picture score? And I want to thank, I, again, I can't think of the name right now, uh, the person that did the review this year on Transformers the movie. He's the one that mentioned this at the end of the film, at the end of his review, or at least towards the end. Uh, this is basically the entire score of Transformers the movie. Um, I previously did have this. I don't know how my cousin did it. He had sent me a, a copy of the score that he'd somehow downloaded, I guess, offline somewhere. Or some, um, uh, he, had, he had somehow uh, downloaded. Oh, it's called. Uh, okay, hold on. But he had somehow downloaded the score, and it, it is available. There's no doubt about it. But um, I, I did. You know, I enjoyed that, but the thing is, you know, when I saw this, I felt, well, I, I kind of told myself, yeah, it's nice my cousin gave me the, you know, the burnt copy that he did, but you know, when I saw this, I was like, you know what, I got to get it, and for 20 bucks, it's not too bad. It, it's something that, you know, is a great companion piece when it comes to the soundtrack, and I do have the soundtrack. I have the original CD uh, release of it, which has the cover like this, but with the gray background, and it's by Volcano. And I also have the 20th anniversary edition of the soundtrack as well, which I got from Walmart when I was looking at the one in Lawrence, Kansas. So, nice to have um, part of the soundtrack with me. And I do recommend to anybody, Zara Nizarak, um, Skin, skin Slip, Stout Man, anybody that's a Transformers fan, you should get the soundtrack if you can afford it. It's, it's very affordable, I think. As well as you should get the score as well to go with it because um, There we go. Get the plastic off there. A little bit of static, but that's okay. And there it is. How about that? There's the disc. Here's the booklet. And there it is, a booklet. Pretty much feel that if we can get it out of here. Uh, but... Um, there's the booklet right there, pretty nice. Gives you a little bit of, I guess, a an in-depth story of the score and everything. Really cool.
And some nice pictures from the movies. That's really cool there. Um, really nice. Really nice companion piece. You can tell that Intrad, that's what they are, Intrad, not Intrade, but Intrad really did a, a decent job on it. Yeah, you know, in trade or in trad, whatever they're calling themselves, did a decent, did a great job on the on the booklet. Like I said, did nice little uh, pictures here and there, really nice. And um, do highly recommend getting this for your collection if you're a Transformer fan. And again, there's the CD and nice little uh, detail right there. Uh, with it again it's the entire motion picture score it's something that you know obviously fans have been wanting to get for a while and like I said the only way you could get it at first is through like um, bootlegs and stuff like that not saying those never sounded good but it doesn't sound as good as when some people have said this does but this sounds a lot better so really happy to have it and can't wait to listen to it down the line. It's really good. So definitely recommend getting it for your collection. All right, next up, we have this big one, which supposedly was scheduled to come yesterday, but I guess due to some conflicts or something, it did not. So here's this big one. And it is about... Plenty of items from what I understand in here, so without further ado, let's see what those items are. Again, like I said, originally it was scheduled for uh, yesterday to um, be brought over, but never happened, so let's see what they are. First of all, let's open it up, move some of the plastic over to here. Ooh, oh, got plenty in here. Oh, definitely plenty. Uh, so we'll start off, first of all, with another CD. This one I got from my mom, even though she's got the cassette version. We have Beaches, because she likes the soundtrack to the movie. So I got her the Beaches soundtrack on CD. Uh, there we go there. Pretty cool. And then, speaking of which, I also got her the movie on Blu-ray. Got her the Beaches movie on Blu-ray. She has the, the VHS as well as I bought her the uh, DVD. And I was wondering if maybe this was on Blu-ray, and too much to my surprise, it was. So, you know, there it is. Beaches on Blu-ray. And let's see. It's got special features on here of enhanced high-definition picture and sound. 1989 Grammy-winning Song of the Year, Best and Record of the Year, Wind Beneath, Wind Beneath My Wings, music video performed by Bette Midler. AFI's 100 Years, 100 Songs with Bette Midler. Um, let's see. Maya uh, Blank, uh, Blank remembers Beaches. Barbara Hershey's Screen Test, Auto Commentary with Director Gary Marshall, who also did uh, Pretty Woman. So, there you go right there. It's very nice. And then next up, Oh, this is a funny one. It's definitely recommended for people to get. We have Blended. Very funny movie. One of the Adam Sandler's funniest, along with Drew Barrymore. Very funny. So now we have Blended as part of the collection. And a nice slip cover. And I do recommend to anybody like Zara Nizarak maybe to get this in his collection because he'll definitely get a kick out of it um, in, in the long run uh, as well. It is funny. 
You know, my mom actually DVR'd it. We saw it for the first time at my sister's, and it is good. It's really good. Then next up after that, we have the greatest story ever told. Last year around this time, I got King of Kings. This time, I've got the greatest story ever told on um, Blu-ray. And, you know, since Easter's around the corner, I would recommend getting this in your collection as well. Pretty cool. Uh, let's see, got any special features here? Let's see, uh, special features on Blended is Adam and Drew back together again, Bella Thorne's makeover, Safari Animals, Parasailing, Deleted Scenes, Gag Grill, and more. And then on Greatest Story Ever Told, we have he Walks in Beauty Documentary, Filmmaker Documentary, Deleted Scene, and Theatrical Trailer. So, there you go. Pretty nice. Yeah, pretty nice. Just checking out my dog outside. So, pretty nice. Those are nice extras to have on, on the Blu-ray. Now, up next, speaking of Blu-rays, this was on sale for about, about 60 We can get it out of here. Ugh. There's more of these that are out there for more of a collection. But we have nine of the most well-known movies she's ever made. We have nine Marilyn Monroe movies on Blu-ray. And here we have on here, we have Bus Stop, Niagara, How to Marry a Millionaire. There's No Business Like Show Business, River of No Return, Gentlemen, um, Gentlemen Prefer Blonde, The Seven Year Itch, The Misfits, and Some Like It Hot. Yeah, so... There you go, right there. It's, it's pretty nice to have, and I'll probably open that in just a bit. And then, as far as next up, uh oh, we have the complete official second season of the original Yu Gi Oh! That's right, this is the complete second season. Finally got it. I mean, I've recorded some of it, not all of it. So we finally got it there. There it is, the complete second season on six DVDs, basically three disc sets on two, uh, three, six discs individually uh, comprised on two sets. And then here we have the complete third season, which is the Waking the Dragon season here in the U.S. Again, six CD, and six DVDs. Really, really cool. And what I like about this, when, when you take a look at it, it does compile two things. Um, if I can get them working here. Uh, there we go. It kind of compiles two things. You get Yugi on one side and you get Exodia on the other. So it's really, really cool. And I do have the first season, but I might get the first season like this too. I have the original tin version of the first season. And then last but not least, Oh, yeah. You know, there was a lot of Transformers I wanted as a kid. Never could get them. My cousin usually would get the ones I've been wanting for a while. Well, I finally got one that I've been wanting. This is actually the Japanese version. Well, it's got Japanese uh, text on it. I don't know why. On the box, but... <laughs> anyway, we have... Uh, Ultra... Magnet. That's right. I've been waiting to get Ultra Magnet for a long, long time. I mean, I, I remember they did the commercials for this. This is the commemorative version, though. Basically, the reissue. Basically, it's the same figure as when it first came out. And I remember wanting to get this issue, I mean, get this as a kid for a long, long time. My cousin had it. And, uh, yeah, it was just. Really, just really happy to get it. And here's the thing. I've had this in my Amazon queue for a while. 
I just never had the chance to get it financially until now. So now I finally am able to get Ultra Magnus in the collection and just really happy to get it. Um, let's see, can we, can we open this thing? And of course it shows you the other two. I do have Optimus, I don't have Hot Rod yet, or Rodimus. I think I do have Rodimus, I'm not sure, I gotta check. But, uh, there we go. Well, again, I'm just really happy to have this in the collect, in my